Good evening. I'm Ethan Keller. Welcome to another bo episode of Boring History. Today we're going to be talking about the splitting of the Catholic Church after the schism of 1059. Things went smoothly until corruption started. I would like to be a cardinal. No one pointed out the corruption in the Catholic Church until Martin Luther wrote down his 95 Theses. <laughs> Martin Luther tried to reform the Church. Then he went on to translate the Bible into German. Uh, then there was John Calvin who thought the Christian laws were too soft for people. They weren't strict enough. There was no card playing, dancing, and lights out for everyone, including adults, that's how it should be. John Calvin then also tried to reform the Catholic Church, but he failed as well. So he went on and started Calvinism. Next, King Henry VIII didn't want to share power with the Pope or with his wife. I don't want to share power with anyone. Join my religion, Anglicanism. The Catholic Church tried to stop the Reformation, but even with their changes, people didn't want to come back, and the church was fragmented forever. Well, that's our show for tonight. Tune in next week when we review The Empire Strikes Back.